and good morning. It is the 23rd day of May, 2024. We are on the move. A little after six. Had some thunderstorms last night, but it didn't last long at all. So my stuff didn't get too wet. The, the rain fly in that. And the, my uh, protector that I put on the ground under my tent, so that was good. The pack is light this morning, boys and girls. We have zero water, although I'm going to fill up up here. Not fill up. We got quite a climb this morning. I don't know where the heck the climb jumped out of this morning, but I looked right before I went to bed last night. It's about a 1,300 foot climb this morning. So I was like, wow, I didn't, I guess I didn't see that coming. I see it right here. Not really thrilled about that, but. And then we have, I had a cliff bar for breakfast, and that's it. That's all the food we have left except one freeze-dried meal that I just couldn't bring myself to eat last night because it's the same flavor I've been eating and I just couldn't do it. Plus, I'm not, I haven't got that hiker hungry. I don't know when to get that, but so it was tough to eat and I couldn't do it. So I had a Snickers and a bag of Skittles for dinner. Uh, oh, I got 7.3 miles today, so that should get me there. It's dark. All right, let's see. Uh, let's get some water, get some fluid into me, and then take our time up this uh, ascent this morning, and it's all downhill after that. And we are in the no rain window of 6 and 10. So we should be able to get there before 10 for sure. So as long as Garmin weather doesn't lie, I will be dry. Talk to you later. So the picture you just saw was of a little uh, spring right out of, out of the side of the mountain here. And I had to give video to it because I've talked to a lot of people out here because I don't filter my water and I don't recommend it because I've been doing it for years and I'd like to believe, whether smartly or not, that uh, my gut, if you will, has built up a certain immunity or less sensitive to you know bacteria and maybe a little shaky water. But this here is like a classic. Like it's right over to the side of the mountain. There's no cow fields or anything above, no frog ponds. It's just literally right out of the side of the mountain and that is a spring and I will put that water there up against anyone's well water um, any day of the week and it's nice that people haven't moved all this stuff out because you want that little pool there because springs are great but the problem is is that they dry up um, really fast but that is an awesome one right there um, I'm going to check the fire out app to make sure it's on there Anyway, that's your H2O lesson for the morning. And it gave me a chance to take a break too. Aha. Uh -huh. Lots and lots of ferns. Lots and lots of ferns. Oh, we have a dog back there. They must be hiking with their dog. This must be rich fern soil area. So I don't think I've seen a bigger grouping of ferns. This whole hike is pretty cool though. Let's try 
which is all the way up there. Hmm. It's pretty. Only got about a mile and a half to the hostel, so I am pretty excited. I know I missed their breakfast, but I'm sure they have some things I can buy to eat. Even if I have to microwave something, I'll, it'll sure taste pretty good. I'll let you know what I get. All right, Woods Hole Hostel. I guess even when you get there on some of these, you don't really get there. It's another point four, but it's a road walk and it's a nice day. So we'll just enjoy it because why not? Could be driving around in a car for miles on end trying to get people that want don't want to talk to me to talk to me. So, I'll take this right here. Hope everybody's having a good day. Probably be pretty hard to be having as good a day as I am right now, but I hope you're up there. I'll talk to you soon. Wow. Here it is. This whole hostel. Looks pretty cool. Very cool. Can't wait to, uh, can't wait to check it out. Especially the little grocery store. That one cliff bar for breakfast just did not cut it. And this is the inside of our little glamping safari tent here. Not bad at all, not bad at all. It's got a nice little front deck out there. And a nice view there. That'd be pretty sweet if that's a sunrise or a sunset. And this is the Lona Clothes section. I was able to find something that fits. Still not sure whether I have a women's shirts on or men's, but guys outside weed whacking and mowing. These are the bathrooms. Shower, I showered in there. Some nice, nice hot shower and they have shampoo and everything for you. I think I went seven minutes, but it's okay. And, yeah. And bathroom here in the end. So pretty, pretty nice, uh, pretty nice place. Nice and clean.
And hello everyone. It's not the end of the day, but it's the end of my hiking day. Got some laundry going and just had a cool cheese and homemade bread plate. Check this out. I eat about the whole thing. I gave Solar a little cheese and one slice of bread with some jelly, but that was it. Got some loner clothes on. I think I have some kind of women's pants, but they fit and they'll work till my clothes are washed and dried. I'm just waiting on the dryer now. Uh, Wi-Fi, they have Wi-Fi here, but it's not super strong. So unfortunately, probably won't be able to get any videos up. So I'm gonna be behind three or four days, but I'm hiking to Parisburg tomorrow, 11 miles in the morning to uh, resupply, do like a three or four day resupply and see if I can hit a McDonald's or a library in town there and get some videos uploaded. Um, really looking forward to the dinner tonight and the organic dinner at six o'clock. Um, I can see what they mean about growing their own stuff. They've got heads of broccoli here and a bunch of greens. And I saw some cucumber plants, not ready, but um, some of those. And if it's anything like the cheese and the bread platter, it's going to be really awesome. So I'm looking forward to that. I got like 35 minutes left on my clothes to dry. Then I'll uh, get back into my own clothes. And then try to take at least a couple hour nap, get some stuff charged. Um, repack a little bit and then have dinner and uh, hopefully Raven will be here for dinner. Uh, good to see him again. I haven't seen him in 300 miles, so it'll be good to catch up a little bit. And I don't think the Wi-Fi is going to be good enough to check out the Celtics tonight. I was hoping to watch some of the Celtics on the YouTube TV app, but I don't know. Maybe if I sit right on the uh, outside the main house on the porch, I might get it, but doubtful. But anyway, that's the end of the day. Um, the only thing you're going to get after this probably is a few more pictures. I'll, I'll take a picture of dinner and see, see what that looks like. And, and that'll do it for the day. I will see you all first thing in the morning back on the trail.